Any new information tonight about that helicopter crash that occurred in Riverside County that killed two? Yeah, KCAL assignment editor Mike Rogers is at the desk now. Mike, we understand you spoke with someone who knew the pilot? I did, Jeff and Susie. I was able to have a conversation with that person who we're going to go ahead and hold back some of the information at their request. Just kind of it's a sensitive time for the family and not everybody knows. But what I can share with you uh, is that this pilot was beloved. The family told me that he was a pilot for over a decade, 25 years to be exact, saying uh, he spent his time volunteering to transport organs uh, in his helicopter. That was his own personal helicopter. He used that and volunteered his time for a local nonprofit to do that. Now, uh, the family says that they are just completely devastated and shocked at what happened. We'll tell you, you're looking at the video right now, Riverside County Sheriff's Department responded to this area in Paris uh, when this helicopter went down around noon today. Uh, they said both people on board were killed, the pilot and a passenger. I'm told that passenger also a pilot. Uh, family tonight is very just confused on exactly what happened here. It'll be up for the FAA and the NTSB to kind of determine that. Uh, what you're looking at right now is the exact kind of trail that the helicopter uh, did. They took off out of French Valley and they were headed north up into the mountains. But uh, something happened, something went wrong, and this was the spot on the map here that their helicopter was last seen. As we come back out here to the desk, again, uh, the victims of the crash have not officially been identified. We're going to respect the family's wishes today uh, and not release that information yet either. Uh, as soon as they can notify everybody and then the sheriff makes their official notifications, we'll be sure to let you know. But a really tragic situation today in Riverside County, guys.